Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. There's a cockroach up here. It's not working sufficiently for AFA. You must correct this issue. This issue is driving me insane. We must correct it. The king is here. Where is he? He's talking to the man. No, there's an old lady. Damn it all! Back to work, peasant! No, that's not a... There's a cop up here. Back to work, peasant! I want the cop. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in the court of His Royal Majesty, Josh Abrams, as he makes sure that his serfs are still doing their jobs. That's right, I ended up finding a uh, video of Josh the Jerk on another channel, acting like he's king of the world, and that means he's your king too. I guess that's the reason why he treats everybody he encounters like his damn servants. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hello, hear ye, hear ye, make way for his majesty, AFA. Oh, really? Since when were you the king of the world or anything for that matter, besides king of the Burgers. I mean, it's not easy being a Burger King, is it? I mean, those Whoppers can be real tyrannical. I mean, you know all about that, Josh, would you? Because it looks like you've taken on a few Whoppers yourself, haven't you? Hey, uh, King AFA and his queen. <laughs> queen Banana! We're traveling down. Put your head in the back. They're not supposed to know there's a kid in the car. Just Sometimes it's just I'm stuck with these talentless hacks. Oh, you want to talk about hacks? Well, I can tell you something that you and DMA are both brainless hacks. Especially you, Joshy boy. Well, as far as being hacks go your your second banana your second fiddle to uh the king of the hacks right now which is dma but i'll get to him in another video but you on the other hand are a brainless hack indeed for all those copyright strikes that you sent out and uh claim that well nobody had commentary on them well brother maybe you should at least take a look at a video before you bring it down but then again, what should I expect from a Burger King after all? I mean, your brain is pretty much made up of Whoppers. I mean, they had to go somewhere. I mean, your, your body was full of it, so why not just stuff it somewhere where there was some empty space anyway? No, I'm the king. You keep smiling. Any man who must say I am the king is no true king. You don't have one. We are driving down the street, and as we drive, I take issue with the officer of policy, and I see him generating and collecting revenue. In other words, Burger King, you see an officer doing his job by enforcing the laws and uh, issuing tickets at traffic stops, and you take exception to that because you're an anarchist and you want speed all the way home damn everybody else and whoops if somebody gets hurt because i didn't put on the brakes in time well it's not my fault they shouldn't have gotten in the way and i say nine halt who goes there his majesty afa and queen anna right 
Rue the fuck you! You didn't hear that! Earmuffs! Earmuffs! And that's the reason I stopped you today. Yes. As well. As well. Hello! There is a cockroach up here that I take issue with. He's walking around, stretching his stuff, double fisting a donut in the boot, and the blue line wiping his behind with the American flag. I caught him. Projection much, Burger King, because that's all I ever see you do is wipe your ass with the uh, American flag and the Constitution. Stomping on other people's rights of freedom of speech. And I'm not just talking about myself. I'm talking about everybody you encounter in your audits when you tell them to shut their mouths. Because they have a right to speak just like you do. But you prefer to keep them silent because you're the one talking. And you won't let anybody else talk because you believe that you're in the right because you misquote some laws. Well, big whoopity do, so do thousands of other people that I've seen on YouTube, and none of them are right either. And I'm talking about the frauditors and sovereign citizens. Pretty sure he was talking shit about veterans as well. None of that is true, but I take issue with him. So let's make sure he's doing his job. I shall find him. Where is he? Where's the little penis man? I tell you where you can find him. Just look in the rear view mirror, dude, and you'll see him. I mean, he's clear as day. Where's the cop? Where is he? They're not gone. Oh, yes, 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 Oh, I've met him. Back to work, peasant. Go. Back to work, peasantry. And this is a prime example of the way you communicate with everybody you encounter on your audits. You talk to everybody as if you are the king and they are the lowly peasants and the lowly serfs that, that need to Bow down and lick your boots. Well, Joshy, I'll tell you. I'll tell you exactly what your brand of communication is with every one of those people that you encounter on your, on your audits. That's called tyranny. You're trying to invoke your will on everybody else and make sure that they don't get a word in. It's your way or the highway, so suck it. And that is why you wipe your ass with the flag and the Constitution every time you go out. Because, well, you're trying to abridge people's freedom of speech and make sure that they don't ever get a word in ahead of you. So, which is why I believe this was not an act. This is how you actually feel you actually want to be a king you actually want to be a tyrant you actually want to rule over everybody and make sure that they're on their knees licking your boots you want to make sure they clean those boots mirror finish with their tongues at any rate, guys, I am through with the Burger King for now. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.